The day has come and snow has finally fallen. It's time to take your daily precipitation measurement. You may find, especially in cases where there was little or no wind, that some snow has accumulated on the edge of your gauge. To remedy this, take a flat surface and press it directly down towards the top of your gauge. Some volunteers like to use a highly advanced piece of scientific equipment for this task. A snow swatter. As you press down, some snow falls inside the gauge and some falls out. The snow needs to be melted to take a measurement, so take your gauge inside. Waiting for the snow to melt could take all day. We don't recommend the microwave, and even placing it by the heater would still take a long time. Instead, we're going to add a pre-measured amount of warm water. If you use your inner measuring cylinder, you can measure exactly how much you will put in. Make sure to write it down. Next, pour the warm water into your gauge and slosh it around until the snow melts. Once it's melted, put your funnel atop your inner measuring cylinder and pour in the contents of your gauge. Take a measurement and write it down. Now, simply subtract the warm water that you added from the measurement you just took, and you will have your daily precipitation measurement. Add that measurement into your daily precipitation report in the field that says, rain and melted snow to the nearest hundredth inch that has fallen in the gauge in the last 24 hours. <laughs>